History of Artificial Intelligence 1308 Catalan artist and scholar Ramon Clull distributes Ars Generalis Ultima, the ultimate general art, further culminating his strategy for utilizing paper-based mechanical intents to make new information from blends of ideas. 1666 Mathematician and savant Gottfried Leibniz distributes Dissertatio de Art Combinatoria, on the combinatorial art, following Ramon Clull in proposing a letters in order of human idea and contending that all thoughts are only mixes of a moderately modest number of straightforward ideas. 1726 Jonathan Swift distributes Gulliver's Travels, which incorporates a portrayal of the engine, a machine on the island of Laputa, and a satire of Clull's thoughts, a project for improving speculative knowledge by viable and mechanical operations. By utilizing this invention, the most uninformed person at a sensible charge, and with a little substantial labor, may compose books in philosophy, poetry, politics, law, mathematics, and theology, with minimal assistance from genius or study. 1763 Thomas Bayes builds up a structure for thinking about the likelihood of occasions. Bayesian derivation will turn into a main methodology in AI. 1854 George Boole contends that consistent thinking could be performed deliberately in similar way as tackling an arrangement of conditions. 1898 At an electrical presentation in the as of late finished Madison Square Garden, Nikola Tesla makes an exhibit of the world's first radio-controlled vessel. The boat was furnished with, as Tesla depicted, an acquired psyche. 1914 The Spanish specialist Leonardo Torres y Quevedo shows the main chess playing machine, equipped for ruler and rook against Lord Endgames with no human intercession. 1921 Czech author Karol Kopec presents Robot, in his play R.U.R. Rossum's Universal Robots. Robot comes from, Robota, work. 1925 Houdina Radio Control delivers a radio controlled driverless vehicle, venturing to every part of the roads of New York City. 1927 The sci fi film Metropolis is delivered. It includes a robot twofold of a worker young lady, Maria, which releases Bedlam in Berlin of 2026. It was the principal robot portrayed on film, rousing the Art Deco look of C3PO in Star Wars. 1929 Makoto Nishimura plans Gakutensoku, Japanese for gaining from the laws of nature, the principal robot worked in Japan. It could change its look and move its head and hands through a pneumatic stress component. 1943 Warren S. McCulloch and Walter Pitts distribute a logical calculus of the ideas imminent in nervous activity in the Bulletin of Mathematical Biophysics. This compelling paper, wherein they talked about organizations of romanticized and improved on fake neurons, and how they may perform basic sensible capacities, will turn into the motivation for PC-based, neural organizations, and later, profound learning, and their famous depiction is, imitating the mind. 1949 Edmund Berkeley distributes giant brains, or machines that think in which he states, as of late there have been a decent arrangement of information about unusual monster machines that can deal with data with huge speed and expertise. These machines are like what a mind would be on the off chance that it were made of equipment and wire rather than fragile living creature and nerves. A machine can deal with data, it can figure, finish up, and pick. It can perform sensible tasks with data. A machine, thusly, can think. 1949 Donald Hebb distributes Organization of Behavior, a neuropsychological theory in which he proposes a hypothesis about learning dependent on guesses in regards to neural organizations and the capacity of neurotransmitters to fortify or debilitate over the long run. 1950 Claude Shannon's Modifying a Computer for Playing Chess is the originally distributed article on building up a chess playing PC program. 1950 Alan Turing distributes Registering Machinery and Intelligence, in which he proposes the impersonation game, which will later get known as the Turing Test. 1951 Marvin Minsky and Dean Edmonds fabricate SNARC, Stochastic Neural Analog Reinforcement Calculator, the main counterfeit neural organization, utilizing 3,000 vacuum cylinders to reproduce an organization of 40 neurons. 1952 Arthur Samuel builds up the principal PC checkers playing program and the main PC program to learn all alone. 
August 31, 1955 The expression, man-made consciousness, is authored in a proposition for a multi-month, ten-man investigation of man-made reasoning, presented by John McCarthy, Dartmouth College, Marvin Minsky, Harvard University, Nathaniel Rochester, IBM, and Claude Shannon, Bell Telephone Laboratories. The workshop, which occurred a year later, in July and August 1956, is for the most part considered as the authority birth date of the new field. December 1955 Herbert Simon and Alan Newell build up the Logic Theorist, the primary man-made consciousness program, which ultimately would demonstrate 38 of the initial 52 hypotheses in Whitehead and Russell's Principia Mathematica. 1957 Frank Rosenblatt builds up the Perceptron, an early fake neural organization empowering design acknowledgement dependent on a two-layer PC learning organization. The New York Times revealed the Perceptron to be the undeveloped organism of an electronic PC that the Navy expects will actually want to walk, talk, see, compose, recreate itself and be aware of its reality. The New Yorker considered it a striking machine, fit for a mount's opinion. 1958 John McCarthy creates programming language Lisp which turns into the most famous programming language utilized in man-made consciousness research. 1959 Arthur Samuel coins the expression, AI, giving an account of programming a PC, so it will figure out how to play a preferable round of checkers over can be played by the individual who composed the program. 1959 Oliver Selfridge distributes, Mayhem, a worldview for learning, in the proceedings of the Symposium on Mechanization of Thought Processes, where he portrays a model for an interaction by which PCs could perceive designs that have not been determined ahead of time. 1959 John McCarthy distributes projects with common sense, in the proceedings of the Symposium on Mechanization of Thought Processes, wherein he portrays the advice taker, a program for taking care of issues by controlling sentences in proper dialects with a definitive goal of making programs that gain from their experience as viably as people do. 1961 The principal modern robot, Unamit, begins chipping away at a sequential construction system in a General Motors plant in New Jersey. 1961 James Slagle creates Saint, Symbolic Automatic Integrator, a heuristic program that tackled emblematic reconciliation issues in green bean math. 1964 Daniel Bobrow finishes his MIT PhD thesis named Common Language Input for a Computer Problem Solving System, and creates Student, a characteristic language understanding PC program. 1965 Herbert Simon predicts that, machines will be competent, inside 20 years, of accomplishing any work a man can do. 1965 Hubert Dreyfus distributes speculative chemistry and AI, contending that the brain isn't care for a PC and that there were limits past which AI would not advance. 1965 I.J. Great writes in, Hypotheses concerning the first ultra-intelligent machine, that the first ultra-intelligent machine is the last development that man need at any point make, given that the machine is sufficiently submissive to reveal to us how to monitor it. 1965 Joseph Weizenbaum creates ELISA, an intelligent program that carries on an exchange in English language on any subject. Weizenbaum, who needed to show the triviality of correspondence among man and machine, was amazed by the quantity of individuals who ascribed human-like sentiments to the PC program. 1965 Edward Feigenbaum, Bruce G. Buchanan, Joshua Lederberg, and Carl Gerassi begin dealing with DENDRAL at Stanford University. The main master framework, it computerized the dynamic cycle and critical thinking conduct of natural scientific experts, with the overall point of examining theory arrangement and developing models of exact enlistment in science. 1966 Shaky the robot is the primary universally useful portable robot to have the option to reason about its own behavior. In a Life magazine 1970 article about this first electronic individual, Marvin Minsky is cited saying with certitude, in from three to eight years we will have a machine with the overall insight of a normal person. 1968 The film 2001, Space Odyssey is delivered, including HAL, a conscious PC. 1968 Terry Winograd creates SHRDLU, an early common language understanding PC program. 
1969 Arthur Bryson and Yu Chi Ho portray backpropagation as a multi-stage dynamic framework enhancement technique. A learning calculation for multifacet fake neural organizations, it has contributed essentially to the achievement of profound learning during the 2000s and 2010s, when registering power has adequately progressed to oblige the preparation of huge organizations. 1969 Marvin Minsky and Seymour Papert distribute Perceptrons, an introduction to computational geometry, featuring the restrictions of basic neural organizations. In an extended release distributed in 1988, they reacted to claims that their 1969 decisions altogether decreased subsidizing for neural organization research. Our form is that progress had effectively gone to a virtual end due to the absence of sufficient fundamental speculations. By the mid 1960s, there had been a considerable number of analyses with perceptrons. However, nobody had the option to clarify why they had the option to perceive specific sorts of examples and not others. 1970 The primary human robot, the WABOT-1, is worked at Waseda University in Japan. It comprised of an appendage control framework, a dream framework and a discussion framework. 1972 MYCIN, an early master framework for recognizing microscopic organisms causing serious diseases and suggesting anti-infection agents, is created at Stanford University. 1973 James Light Hill reports to the British Science Research Council on the state computerized reasoning examination, inferring that, in no piece of the field have revelations made so far delivered the significant effect that was then guaranteed, prompting radically decreased government support for AI research. 1976 computer researcher Raj Reddy distributes discourse recognition by machine. A review, in the proceedings of the IEEE, Summing up the early work on natural language processing, NLP. 1978 The XCON, Expert Configurer, Program. A standard-based master framework aiding the requesting of DECs VAX PCs via consequently choosing the segments dependent on the client's necessities, is created at Carnegie Mellon University. 1979 The Stanford CART effectively crosses a seat-occupied room without human intercession in around five hours, getting probably the most punctual illustration of a self-sufficient vehicle. 1980 WABOT2 is worked at Waseda University in Japan, a performer humanoid robot ready to speak with an individual, read a melodic score and play tunes of normal trouble on an electronic organ. 1981 The Japanese Ministry of International Trade and Industry Financial Plans $850 million for the fifth generation computer project. The venture expected to create PCs that could carry on discussions, decipher dialects, decipher pictures, and reason like people. 1984 Electric Dreams is delivered, a film about an affection triangle between a man, a lady and a PC. 1984 at the yearly gathering of AAAI, Roger Shank and Marvin Minsky caution of the coming, simulated intelligence winter, anticipating a natural blasting of the AI bubble, which happened three years after the fact, like the decrease in AI speculation and exploration subsidizing during the 1970s. 1986 first driverless vehicle, a Mercedes-Benz van outfitted with cameras and sensors, worked at Bundeswehr University in Munich under the course of Ernst Dickmann's, drives up to 55 miles per hour on void roads. October 1986 David Rumelhart, Jeffrey Hinton, and Ronald Williams distribute, learning portrayals by back engendering blunders, in which they depict, another learning technique, backspread, for organizations of neuron-like units. 1987 The Video Knowledge Navigator, going with Apple CEO John Scully's feature discourse at Educom, imagines a future where information applications would be gotten to by keen specialists working over networks associated with monstrous measures of digitized data. 1988 Judea Pearl distributes probabilistic reasoning in intelligent systems. His 2011 Turing Award reference peruses, Judea Pearl made the authentic and computational establishment for the preparing of data under vulnerability. He is credited with the innovation of Bayesian organizations, a numerical formalism for characterizing complex likelihood models, just as the main calculations utilized for surmising in these models. This work upset the field of man-made reasoning as well as turned into a significant instrument for some different parts of designing and the common sciences. 
1988 Rollo Carpenter builds up the visit bot Jabberwacky to recreate characteristic human talk in a fascinating, engaging and amusing way. It is an early effort to make man-made reasoning through human connection. 1988 Members of the IBM TJ Watson Research Center distribute a factual way to deal with language interpretation, proclaiming the shift from rule-based to probabilistic techniques for machine interpretation, and mirroring a more extensive shift to AI in light of measurable investigation of known models, not perception and comprehension of the job needing to be done. IBM's venture Condeed, effectively deciphering among English and French, depended on 2.2 million sets of sentences, for the most part from the bilingual procedures of the Canadian Parliament. 1988 Marvin Minsky and Seymour Papert distribute an extended release of their 1969 book Perceptrons. In Introduction, A View from 1988, they stated, one motivation behind why progress has been so delayed in this field is that specialists new to its set of experiences have kept on committing a significant number of the very errors that others have made before them. 1989 Yan Le Kun and different analysts at AT&T Bell Labs effectively apply a backpropagation calculation to a multifacet neural organization, perceiving written by hand zip codes. Given the equipment impediments at that point, it required around three days, still a huge improvement over prior endeavors, to prepare the organization. 1990 Rodney Brooks distributes Elephants Don't Play Chess, proposing another way to deal with AI, building clever frameworks, explicitly robots, from the beginning and based on continuous actual connection with the climate, the world is its own best model, try to detect it suitably and regularly enough. 1993 Werner Vinge distributes The Coming Technological Singularity, where he predicts that, inside 30 years, we will have the mechanical way to make superhuman knowledge. Soon after, the human time will be finished. 1995 Richard Wallace builds up the chatbot ALICE, Artificial Linguistic Internet Computer Entity, roused by Joseph Weizenbaum's ELISA program, however with the expansion of normal language test information assortment on a phenomenal scale, empowered by the coming of the web. 1997 Sepp Hochreiter and Jürgen Schmidhuber propose Long Short Term Memory, LSTM, a sort of an intermittent neural organization utilized today in penmanship acknowledgement and discourse acknowledgement. 1997 Deep Blue turns into the main PC chess playing system to beat an authoritative world chess champion. 1998 Dave Hampton and Caleb Chung make Furby, the main homegrown or pet robot. 1998 Yan Le Kun, Yoshua Bengio and others distribute papers on the use of neural organizations to penmanship acknowledgement and on upgrading backpropagation. 2000 MIT's Cynthia Breziel creates Kismet, a robot that could perceive and reenact feelings. 2000 Honda's ASIMO robot, a misleadingly smart humanoid robot, can stroll as quick as a human, conveying plate to clients in a cafe setting. 2001 AI Man-Made Reasoning is Delivered, a Steven Spielberg film about David, an untainted android exceptionally modified with the capacity to adore. 2004 The Principal DARPA Grand Challenge, a prize rivalry for self-ruling vehicles, is held in the Mojave Desert. None of the self-governing vehicles completed the 150-mile course. 2006 Oren Etzioni, Michelle Banco, and Michael Caffarella coined the expression, machine perusing, characterizing it as an intrinsically unaided, independent comprehension of text. 2006 Jeffrey Hinton distributes, learning multiple layers of representation, summing up the thoughts that have prompted multifacet neural organizations that contain hierarchical associations and preparing them to create tangible information as opposed to arrange it, i.e., the new ways to deal with profound learning. 2007 Fei Li and partners at Princeton University begin to amass ImageNet, an enormous information base of commented on pictures intended to help in visual article acknowledgement programming research. 2009 Rajat Rayner, Anand Madhavan and Andrew N.G. distribute, enormous scope deep unsupervised learning utilizing graphics processes, contending that, cutting-edge illustrations processes far outperform the computational abilities of multi-core CPUs, and can possibly change the relevance of profound solo learning strategies. 
2009 Google begins creating, stealthily, a driverless vehicle. In 2014, it turned into the first to pass, in Nevada, a U.S. state self-driving test. 2009 Computer researchers at the Intelligent Information Laboratory at Northwestern University create StatsMonkey, a program that composes sport reports without human mediation. 2010 Launch of the ImageNet Large Scale Visual Recognition Challenge ILSVCR, a yearly AI object acknowledgement rivalry. 2011 A convolutional neural organization wins the German traffic sign recognition rivalry with 99.46% exactness, versus people at 99.22%. 2011 Watson, a characteristic language question noting PC, contends on Jeopardy. Also, routes two previous heroes. 2011 researchers at the IDSIA in Switzerland report a 0.27% blunder rate in penmanship acknowledgement utilizing convolutional neural organizations, a huge improvement more than the 0.35% to 0.40% mistake rate in earlier years. June 2012 Jeff Dean and Andrew NG report on a trial in which they showed an exceptionally enormous neural organization 10 million unlabeled pictures arbitrarily taken from YouTube recordings, and, to our delight, one of our fake neurons figured out how to react emphatically to pictures of felines. October 2012 A convolutional neural organization planned by specialists at the University of Toronto accomplish a mistake pace of just 16% in the ImageNet Large Scale Visual Recognition Challenge, a huge improvement more than the 25% blunder rate accomplished by the best section the prior year. Walk 2016 Google DeepMind's AlphaGo Routes Go Hero Lee Sedol. The web, particularly Wikipedia, is an incredible hotspot for the historical backdrop of man-made consciousness. Other key sources incorporate Nils Nielsen, The Quest for Artificial Intelligence, A History of Ideas and Achievements, Stuart Russell and Peter Norvig, Artificial Intelligence, A Modern Approach, Pedro Domingo's, The Master Algorithm, How the Quest for the Ultimate Learning Machine Will Remake Our World, and Artificial Intelligence and Life in 2030. Thanks for watching. Bye now. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to Life is Often if you haven't already clicked the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.